everybody, Kiara here back with another episode of Pokemon Brilliant Diamond for the Nintendo Switch. Last time we left off, we defeated the Eterna City gym leader, Gardenia, who nearly destroyed me. She kicked my butt hard. Um, oh, that's a cool picture. <laughs> I'm just like, that's a cute, that, that's a cool picture. Okay, anyways, I was just making sure that's actually what I did um, last time, because I completely forgot. Anyways, we defeated Gardenia in her really difficult gym, and now I believe we shall be heading into here, because for defeating her, you learn the hidden move cut, so we need to explore this place now. Hold on, you guys. Sorry. Um, there's a cat on the bookshelf. Hold on, give me one moment, you guys. Dude. Hey, hey. Miko's on the bookshelf. Look inside the Team Galactic Eterna building. Sorry the camera's shaking so much, you guys. Alright, I think I got it. Okay, I'm holding it. Uh, look inside the building. Okay. Team Galactic isn't interested in the world. Our gaze is beyond the stars. It's in your name. Welcome to Team Galactic. Are you here to donate your Pokemon? What? You're not? Then kindly get off our property. Do we have to bring the pain like we did with the cycle shop manager? Yes, you do. Oh, we're battling in your building? We are gathering Pokemon for an astonishing undertaking. Your meddling won't be tolerated. Sorry, dearie. Team Galactic doesn't accept children as members. How dare you call me a child? I am 10 years old. How dare you call me a child? Staravia and Machop? What? Machop? Okay. Let's go with that. I guess. Knock off. So from last episode, I remember there was a kid that wanted me to trade him a weasel. So therefore I need to figure out where I caught my weasel so I could trade him a weasel. Because I still need a weasel to fill, uh, to have float soul in my Pokedex. So yeah, I completely forget where I caught my weasel. I don't know where I caught it. But I caught it somewhere. Obviously, right? Somewhere. Because I don't think I got it in the water, right? I, I definitely don't know swim yet. Or surf. And I don't have a fishing rod yet either, so... It was somewhere in the grass. I feel like I got meddled with. That's because you did. <laughs> but, but, dear, you're just a kid. I am not just a kid. Okay, I am the future champion of the region, so you better respect me. Come on, cats. 
The cats are seriously doing this now? I just hit <laughs> the, the microphone, you guys. <laughs> Probably sounded weird. Anyways, let's go upstairs. Team Galactic is working hard to find new energy sources for the future. Our objectives are incredible, too incredible for me to understand. I'll fight blindly to defend them, and your intrusion won't be forgiven. Oh, these are some weak Pokemon. <laughs> these are some ex extremely weak Pokemon. And I need to switch Star Wavia out. Forgot to. Star Wavia cannot be the first Pokemon. I only used Star Wavia for the gym battle. And now I need to switch her out. Him out. I don't know what gender it is. Um, Pokemon. It is a female. Okay, I need to switch her out with Prinplup. I always have starter Pokemons up at the top, unless for gym battles or unless they're weak, right? Unless they're like poisoned or something. Let's see how good this Pokemon is. I stole it from some weak trainer. Okay. Let's see how good it is. See, here's the thing. Here's the thing, you guys. They could steal... Steal Pokemon. You know, steal with uh, quotation marks. But... If they belong to another trainer, how do they get into someone else's Pokeball? That's the question. If this Silcoon belonged to someone else, how could this Team Galactic Grunt catch it? Like, you can't do that. You can't catch someone else's Pokemon. That's like uh, Pokemon 101. <laughs> How to be a trainer. You cannot catch someone else's Pokemon. But all these teams always say they're stealing Pokemon. And I mean, they do win the games, right? But it's not possible. It's not possible, but yet it is. We are conducting research on new forms of energy. We want to harness the mysterious power of Pokemon. Cool. Have fun with that. Could I see what you guys are looking at? No? No? Okay. Could I have these pens? Color pencils? I don't know. I don't know what they are. But they're pretty. Why, thank you. We love it when people come to, to us to donate their Pokemon. I'm not donating Pokemon. Oh yeah, I poisoned her. Uh, it's fine. I'm saying, eh, it's fine. Poisoning won't take effect if the opponent has multiple Pokemon.
Um, um, I apologize to you guys for the inconvenience. Oh my gosh. I apologize, you guys, for the inconvenience. The TV just said no signal. Um, I fixed it, though. I fixed it. I kind of uh, tripped on a cord as I was trying to get Winter away from the bookshelf. I tripped on a cord. And that pulled the extension cord which pulled out the Nintendo Switch that's connected, right, the Nintendo Switch cord, which turned off the TV, or it took away the screen. Anyways, I fixed it. That's all that matters. Fixed it really quickly. It went back really quickly. It's fine. We're fine. Machop is level 21. When does Machop evolve? It has three evolutions, so it's gotta be soon, right? Ordinary people like you can't understand Team Galactic's grand designs. Come to think of it, I don't even know what's going on. <laughs> Are you new here? Our mission is to implement our operations without question. It is all for the new world order that our boss will lead. Who is said boss? Cyrus? Is that his name? Cyrus? Ooh. A Kadabra. Okay, close. Good thing this is your only Pokemon. Good thing. Level 24. Not bad. You are not learning swagger. <laughs> that was that was so sudden. I was like, not bad. You are not learning swagger. Oh gosh, he looks mad. Anyway, swagger is a bad move. Um, got another one of these boom boxes. Oh hey, it's Saturn. Ah, <gasps> it's Saturn. Oh, I didn't need to save this guy, huh? Could I just talk to your Pokemon? Mion. Did you steal these Pokemon? That sounded so sad. P. Hello. Can you see me? I'm talking to you. No? Okay. This is Saturn. A. Did you want something? How silly me to even ask. You want to free the Pokemon? Yeah, that's gonna happen. It's Commander Saturn. She has crazy hair, but yeah, I love the color. Actually, it's not Saturn. It's Jupiter. I totally was just tricking you guys. Totally was just tricking you guys. Alright, Jupiter. Let's dance. Mean look. Alright, why would I want to escape? Because I'm poisoned? That's not going to do anything. How insolent. Take a bite of this, child. I'll show you who's a child. Jupiter. Jupiter. Gun tank. Level 20. You have some good Pokemon. 
You have some very good Pokemon. I take that back. They are terrible Pokemon. You're gonna faint, Prinplup. Ooh. That was a close one. Alright, let's go here. Uh, I haven't fought against a skunk tank before. So I have no idea what's effective, not very effective, what some call it. So I know flying is effective, right? It's just effective. I have no idea what's super effective against uh, poison. Poison dark? Is it a poison dark? And no snarl, which is a dark type move. But then again, it could just be, you know, Skuntank. Skuntank is uh, just a poison type. Poison types can learn dark type moves, right? A berry. Really? Flamethrower. Okay. Well, that's just Skuntank. That's normal for a skunting. Uh, electric is fine, right? Electric is good against poison. Luxia is so cute. Look at my little dog. I mean, it's not little, but I mean. Technically, it's a cat, right? Luxia is a cat, right? I feel like Luxio is supposed to be a lion, and lion's a cat, so yeah. Okay, that didn't work. Okay. Don't worry, you guys. I got this. I got this. Poison. Poison against poison. Sure. Mm. Oh. Sorry, guys. Uh, poison against poison. That was terrible. <laughs> okay, supersonic. I rarely use this move, but we're gonna do it. We are gonna do it. <laughs> now I'm burned. Are you kidding me here? Oh my gosh, Zubat. Alright, well, I'm gonna use you to um, heal. We only have potions? That's not gonna help. Alright. I could run away from this battle. I'm so random. But seriously, I barely realized that run away button option. You can't run away from Pokemon battles. But I guess now you can? I don't know. Uh, fighting and dark are not super effective against this Pokemon, but we are going to try it. Anyways, they let you run away from battles. That was awful. It's awful, Machop. Very, very awful. Alright, come on, you're just like a gardenia. You're just like a gardenia. Why are you so strong? Jupiter, Saturn, whoever you are? Um, tackle. Sure. Poison gas. You're smart too. 
you know that fire won't be super effective. Alright. Oh my gosh. There you go. Aftermath? What does that do? I was hurt. Aftermath? Never heard of that one before. Whirlwind. That doesn't do damage, huh? No. Commander Jupiter. Losing to some child. Being careless cost me too much. Nice. Well, aren't you tough? It's okay, though. Our official Pokemon stat statue investigation is finished. And Mars has collected energy from the Valley Windworks. We're pretty much finished here. I'll let you in on one little thing. Our boss is researching the myth... Uh, can't speak. The myths of ancient Pokemon. With the power of mythical Pokemon, he will become the ruler of Sinnoh. I suggest you keep out of Team Galactic's affairs from now on. This is your last warning. I got my Clefairy back and it's all thanks to you, but that Team Galactic, they said Clefairy came from space, hand it over. Their logic baffles me still. It's like they are from space. Anyway, they're gone now. Thank you very much. I can't thank you enough right now, but cruise by the cycle shop, okay? I sure will. They're all gone. It's empty now. Could I could I buy this place? Be like, I want to live here. It has like three stories. Look, I have a library. It's chock full of Pokemon books and photo collections. Why do you put photo collections in a library? I don't know. Is there anything over here? No. Something over here. A Pokeball. TM46 Thief. That move steals an item from an opponent, right? Like you use it on the opponent and then it just takes the item and then it also damages them. I think. I'm not sure. But I think. Alright, let's stop by the cycle shop, you guys. Stop by the cycling shop. Let's get us a bike. I've been waiting so long for this moment. Hello. Aren't you supposed to stand at the register? Thanks for rescuing me. I can't thank you enough. Say, let me give you a bike to show my gratitude. Please come with me for a moment. Okay. Um, where are we going? I'd like you to choose a color for your bike. Which one will it be? Um, out of these? Oh god. Blue. Blue's the best. Oh my gosh, that's so cool! <laughs> do you want a blue bike? Of course I do. Marvelous, you've chosen a dignified blue. It almost seems like you can see the bubbles of Squirrel reflected in it. It's perfect for you. It matches my hair. <laughs> matches my hair. You obtained the bike. I put it in my backpack, apparently. It's the latest model, so I'll read the operating manual to you. Press the B button to shift gears, it says. In third gear, the bike cannot reach full speed, but it will be easier to handle. In fourth gear, it can ride at full speed and climb up slopes. Your bike can take you through all sorts of towns, roads, and routes. Now get out there and ride. I look so awesome. Press B button to speed up or improve control. Ooh. 
And this one is slower, okay. So it's only two speeds though. Only two speeds. Alright, well I prefer this speed, it's more easier to control. <laughs> um, so where are we going next? So I think I'm done here. I need to find that weasel. I'm keeping that at the back of my mind. At the back of my mind. If I find a weasel, I'll come back here and give it to that kid. Um, but it says travel south on cycling road. So south is obviously down, right? I have to go down. I have to go here. I have to go to cycling road. Let's go. We gotta go cycle on this road. Kiara, a long time no see. Oh, you look puzzled. You're running away. I am. <laughs> I definitely am. I'm Professor Rowan's assistant and Lucas's father. Okay, that makes sense. I've come a long way at the behest of a professor, of the professor to help you on your adventure. Let me ask you, how many Pokemon have you met? Oh my, you've met 41. Wonderful. Yes, bravo. Professor Rowan should be delighted. Here's something for you. Rare candy. Giving a rare candy to a Pokemon will instantly increase that Pokemon's level by one. You can raise your weak Pokemon or you could train your strong Pokemon. Use them as you like. Also, a Pokemon you get in a trade may disobey you if it is too high in level. Don't worry though, it will obey if you have enough gym badges. Is that all? Okay. Learn how to shift gears, you'll be able to ride anywhere. Okay, you guys are twins. Nice. Route 206. Ooh, cycling road. <laughs> ah, one person already. Having a good time cycling? Cyclist Axel. Ooh, my biking outfit looks so cool. I want that outfit in real life. That is awesome. So pretty. Nice. Luxio and Geodude, level 22. Bulldoze. Sure thing. Uh, forget. Rollouts. Yeah, might as well. It's the weakest attack. It does get stronger with each turn, but still, he has not been that good with it. Its accuracy has not been that great. Hey, not bad, you. Thanks, I guess. Whoa. Hold on, what? Hey, watch where you're going. Or did you want to challenge me? Um, I didn't go that way? Does that make sense, you guys? Ooh, a ponytail. <gasps> I need myself a ponytail. Anyways, I didn't click down to ride down. It did that on its own. I don't know why, but it did that on its own. Is that what Cycling Road does to you? The controls move on their own? I don't know. My efforts were meaningless. They sure were. Right up. Right up. Why do you keep going? Look at this. She keeps going down. <laughs> I worked up a good sweat riding. I'm feeling great. Let's battle. Like when I just let go of the stick, she just rides down. Is that how that's supposed to be? So I have to like keep holding up if I want her to go up, but then let go if I want her to go down? It's weird.
Almost level 25. Almost. Phew, you worked us over. And now she's writing down. And you guys will actually have to continue next time, you guys. Next time, we will continue down the cycling road. I don't know how long it is. It might just honestly be that next person. But... We'll have to continue on cycling road. And, uh, what's it called? Where are we supposed to go? Well, anyways, we're just supposed to get past cycling road. So... That will happen next time. Heal them up. Okay. And I will see you guys next time for more Pokemon Brilliant Diamond.